everyone, Kiva here. Welcome to my channel. So anyway, these are the essentials that you're gonna need to take with you when you're potty training or when you have a toddler who is potty trained who needs to go to the bathroom. Or if you have kids, like if you just have kids and you just want to keep them safe while in the bathroom, especially now during this pandemic, you wanna keep them safe while they go, continue watching this video because there are some pretty good stuff that I have that is able to fit in a backpack or a diaper bag or a purse that you can easily travel with. So first things first, I want to tell you that everything that I'm going to mention in this video is linked in my description, which it has easy access to get to. You just click and order to get it right in the mail. This particular item that I'm about to show y'all is a very life, it's like sanity saving for me. I had this before when London, London. I had this before when Ashlyn was a toddler and it's called the, it wasn't this brand that I got Ash, but this one's called Joel. I think it's called Joel. So it is a travel baby seat. It folds up in fours and it fits right in this bag. So when you open this bag, you're gonna pull out this potty seat that's folded into fours. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it up for you. Okay, so on the bottom of the toilet seat, you will see suctions. This helps the toilet seat stay in place. That way your child will not be slipping and sliding when this toilet seat is on top of the toilet. And also, it keeps, well, yeah, it just keeps your child in place. So, I personally think that's disgusting because, um, yeah, it suctions to a public potty seat. That's gross to me. So, this is where the next item comes into place, and that is antibacterial wipes. But what I do with the wipes is I take a couple out, I wipe the toilet seat first, then I stick this on top of the toilet seat. All right, I don't even know where I left off. My camera just shut off, so, hmm. All right, so I was telling you guys that I'm, pre I'm pretty sure I was telling y'all that what I do after I take out the potties that I clean the suctions off really good. I wipe them down with the um, antibacterial wipes. And then I close it up like this, nice and compact, just how I like it. And I put it in the little bag that they provide. They It comes with this little bag. And you just zip it up. And it fits perfectly in your bag. Okay, so the next item that I also take with me that I unfortunately rarely use but i think it's smart to always take with you even if you have other children who use public bathrooms with you i take these toilet seat covers the original intent for me buying these is to put the toilet seat cover on the public toilet and then putting that joel to go potty seat on it as well but since sometimes you just don't if if your child really has to go to the bathroom you really don't have time to sit there and think to grab this, open it, place it nice and neat on the toilet seat and then put the toilet seat on top. It's just sometimes you don't think that way and so you just hurry up and put it on there so they can go. But I still, I mean, I did do this one time at Ikea. I hurried up, opened a pack, put it on top of the toilet seat and put the travel seat on top of that and then put it on there. It really, it was like maybe a 10 second time difference but I feel like as a parent, you're trying to hurry up and put them on the potty seat because you don't want them to have an accident out in public. So I still do carry these around. I actually need to put some in my bag right now as we are speaking to each other. So um, another thing I like about these is that they're individually wrapped. I know like it's kind of wasteful of plastic, but I feel like it keeps them clean when they are in your bag. So um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and pack three. So I've three children. And it's just easier for them to use the bathroom. But Cameron doesn't sit in the toilet, but you never know. Maybe he'll have to sit on it one day. So the, these are really good to have to just protect, have that extra protection layer on the toilet seat. So I'm gonna go ahead and put these in my bag as well. And they're, they easily just slip in one of the little compartments you have. I put them right here. Boop. Like I said, always carry antibacterial wipes with you as well this next item is more for putting it in your car you can slip it under the seat you can put it maybe in the trunk like if you have an extra compartment to lift up out of the trunk you can put it in there 
but it is the OXO to go potty. Now I like this because as if you're traveling, like taking a road trip, or you're somewhere that does not have an immediate bathroom where you can pull over and your child really has to go, this is the thing that you want to get. So I'm gonna open this up and I'll show y'all how this works. So with this, it opens up on the bottom. It comes with bags. For the second video, I'm gonna do this for y'all. I'm probably gonna regret this later on. So it comes with bags and it has a um, absorbing sheet on the bottom. So what you do, if you open up the bag, Flip it over. See how I slipped it over the potty seat just like this? Push it down. Just like that. And then these little grippers right here. I don't know if you see that. There's like these little grips. And you just kind of like push the bag there so it can hold the seat. I mean, so it can hold them. So it can hold the bag steady. I feel like if you just, even if. Like, I think I kind of punched the hole in the bag and on accident. See, it already came out. So honestly, I think if you just do this, put the handles under the legs, it should give you enough leeway. And then so what they do is they sit on the potty and they use the bathroom. This liner in there is supposed to absorb as much liquid as it possibly can. So when the child gets done, you just simply take the bag off of the toilet seat, carefully of course, and, and you grab it, take it right off, and the contents will be in the bag of course, and you just tie it up and you throw it away. So like I said, these bags come with the potty, but me, 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 I'm very, like I'm trying to not waste as much plastic so I went ahead and ordered these potty replacement bags. They're biodegradable and compostable. So I feel, so when they go to the bathroom, I feel better about throwing these away in the trash more than I would with throwing this plastic away because I don't think this is biodegradable or compostable, but I know for a fact that these are and I just feel much better about throwing this away in the trash than plastic because I mean, honestly, everything I get, even dog poop bags, I get biodegradable dog poop bags because there's just so much plastic being wasted. This, it says, avoid excessive heat and store in a cool, dry place. So you don't wanna store this in your car, but you can still store these in your diaper bag. You can get a couple of these bags, fold them up nice and neatly, place them in, <laughs> place them in your diaper bag or your backpack, yep. So this comes in a nice like durable bag. It's, I think it comes like this because it's easy to clean. Like you can easily disinfect the inside if you want to take a wipe. Clean up the inside, clean up the outside, zip it up. Also, this can work for a to-go potty seat to take, huh? You have to go potty? Okay, so this toilet can also be used as a to-go potty. Like you can take, instead of taking the Joel with you, you can easily, um, Gosh, maybe not easily, I can say that. So you click, you push these gray buttons right here, and you can flatten out the legs like that. And you can sit it right on top of the public toilet seat. I haven't tried this before, so I really don't know what it looks like or if it fits over the toilet seats or if it slides, slips. I don't know because I never tried it out, but that's just one thing that they advertise that you can do this like this. And then to close it, you push these same gray buttons like this and close it. Put it in this huge bag. <laughs> close it. Since this is so big, I don't, I knew this was going to be huge. That's why I bought the little collapsible, the four folding potty chair because it seems huge. It's not really that for bag friendly or purse friendly or it's not small and discreet. So that's why I say you can travel with this and put it like under your seat in the car or in the trunk just to always have on hand. 
Another thing you always want to keep, and this is a given, this is obvious for every parent, for every person who is potty training a toddler um, or a child, you always, 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 always want to keep an extra pair of underwear with you at all times because accidents happen. Actually, extra pair of underwear and pants. I need to put pants in this bag, but you always want to keep an extra pair of underwear and pants in the bag because accidents happen. And also you need a wet bag in there just in case you do have accidents to keep the rest of your stuff from obviously not getting wet with urine. You don't want those problems. I myself need to purchase a wet bag. I don't have one. Uh, I don't know why I didn't think to buy one when I was buying all the rest of this stuff, but I will be purchasing one because like I said, it's needed. I'm not using a plastic baggie. I should pack a plastic bag or one of my dogs biodegradable poop bags or you know what you can also pack one of these as your wet bag is biodegradable like I said pack one of these if you want to if you end up ordering this you don't have to order a wet bag you can just put everything in here um so that is all I have for you today I hope you find my tips helpful and if you do please leave a comment down below if you have anything else you want to add on there put your comments down below that will help somebody else and myself in this video and you guys have a blessed day i'll see you in the next one bye